Do you hate your job? Do you feel exploited? And are you feeling lost? If so, this video is for you. Let me ask you the following. Are you feeling lost? Unsure of where you're going? no purpose in life, you're stressed, you're worried, you're anxious or depressed, you're being bullied, micromanaged, being belittled, you're not respected, you have low self-esteem, you're not confident, you're feeling trapped and that you feel that you have no options and you don't know who to turn to. Then you must watch this video until the end because I have some answers for you. Disclaimer, this video is the harsh truth that you need to hear. You may not want to hear some of the things that I've got to say because they might cut a little bit deep, but it's going to help you because because when you can own up to what is happening and you can accept reality, that's when you can move forward. So let me start by reading out some horrific facts about the workplace. 85% of working UK adults hate their jobs. That's 43 million people. 82% of working Americans hate their jobs. Over 70% of working adults are living paycheck to paycheck and they are unfulfilled in their jobs. 46% of British adults have less than a thousand pounds in savings. 25% have less than 200 pounds in their savings. 16% have no savings at all. That's horrific. 27% of Americans have less than $1,000 in savings and 12% of Americans have no savings at all. So it's no wonder people feel so lost and that they don't know who to turn to or what to do because they have no financial empowerment. You are being exploited because you have nothing to fall back on. Therefore, you have to do as you are told. When you look after your money, your money will look after you and it gives you options. Now, what I'm about to say is the harsh truth of the employed world, the rat race, the matrix, the system. And there will be many that will disagree with what I'm about to say because they are living in denial. But this is nothing but facts, what I'm about to say. Okay, so look, let's get down to it. The nitty gritty, the reality. If you are employed, you are a number. That's it. No more than that. You are just a number. And that's the truth. And that really cut some people deep. The system will replace you in 72 hours, regardless of your time served, regardless of the amount of pr promotions that you've had, regardless of how much you've brown nosed and you've sucked up to certain managers to get to where you are, regardless of the political corporate poker game that you've been playing very strategically, you are just a number and they can get rid of you and replace you in 72 hours. That's the harsh reality. Now, disclaimer. Not all companies are the same. There are some companies out there that are really trying to adopt a happy culture, a more balanced, healthier way of working where it's open floor, everyone's got more equality and respect. And there are those companies out there that are really doing a good job to change some of these just old school ways of working that are just saddening people. And it's very simplistic to change that. So I'm glad to say that there are companies out there that are on the mend, they are improving, and they're really working to make sure that people are enjoying their work but also that they've got good life balance. So they are out there, but they are far and few between at the moment. Now, my question to you at this point in the video is, are you suffering with what I call the 12 S's? Now, I've put this together because this is going to hit home right now. Sensible people sell their souls by serving the system and their superiors, staying silent, saddened, suppressed, and losing self-respect to only become a shadow of the person they once knew. Now let that sink in, the 12 S's. You are becoming an individual you don't even know anymore because over a period of time you have been suppressed, you have stayed silent because you are dependent on the income, because you do not have F you money in the bank. You have nothing to fall back on. So you are suppressed and now you are a shadow of a human being that doesn't know right from wrong. You have low self-esteem, low confidence, and you feel that you cannot escape. And I hope that now you're watching this video, it's a wake up call and we can start to make a change. So all of the above, those 12 S's, is why you need to get your money right. Having FU money in the bank allows you to do the following. Rightfully disagree, challenge the norm, go against the grain, stand up for what is right, to keep your dignity, to respect yourself, to not fear management, to not fear human resources, to demand your human respect, which should be a given, to feel confident and independent, to know you have options, if you are not enjoying that job, to know that you can leave at any given moment, to challenge the system if you need to, and so much more when you have financial empowerment. But many people cannot do any of that 
because they need the income. They have no savings, they have no investments, they have not been smart with money, they have kept up with society, they have kept up with the Joneses, they are broke and they are living paycheck to paycheck, Monday to Friday, and they're wasting their money, which is why they are just this crumble of a human being in the workplace and that they cannot escape. And that is their life until their dying age, which is so depressing to say that out loud. And that's why I just wanted this video just to be very straight to the point, no BS. I'm not looking to jeer anyone up here. I just want to get straight to the point. So I quote, systems go terribly out of control when people do not stop or challenge them when they are going mildly wrong. So the example is bad management. When there is this poison and toxic management that is in power and no one challenges them and it just remains. Employees, they come and they go. People quit managers, they don't quit their jobs. And the management and the hierarchy, it never gets dealt with because it was never addressed in the beginning. Because those who can address it, the workers, the staff, the employees, numbers, you know, strength in numbers, when they should be addressing it and saying to the powers that be at the very top, the management is killing us. It's toxic and it's battering us and we're suppressed. We're not happy, we're saddened. That's when it should be dealt with, when you can see a glimpse that it's going wrong. But when the system goes terribly wrong and the bad management is in place, it's deeply rooted, you'll never get rid of them, which is why you have high turnover and people do not enjoy their job, which is why we saw those hor horrific statistics at the beginning of this video, because it's already gone terribly wrong and then it becomes deeply rooted and very hard to get rid of. And that all stems from not being able to speak up because you haven't looked after your money or you're not making enough money. So this should highlight the fact that you should be bringing in more streams of income. All of us who are watching this video should be learning a new skill set and generating multiple streams of income. I'll finish with this. Every adult has a decision with two options only. There is no in between, there is no debate to be had after what I'm about to say. You can design your life or you can be assigned one. I designed my life. I escaped the nine to five. You can position yourself in the market or the market will position you. You can make a plan or society has a plan for you. You choose. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please do like and subscribe. Leave me a comment on what maybe your key takeaways were or what did you relate to or resonate with most. You can also put suggestions of the videos you'd like me to cover off. There'll be a couple of videos next to me which you can go on to watch. And until next time, enjoy. I hope this hit home. That was its purpose. I'll see you all soon.